Well, unfortunately, the old silver Monte Carlo has bit to dust today. It's on my way home from work and uh, driving down the road. And I stopped at a stoplight and the car next to me was making some funny noises. So I thought maybe their car was messed up. They didn't think nothing about the Monte Carlo here. And the car took off and I took off and sound like he had a rod knocking in his car. So I was thinking, man, good God, sucks to have a rod knocking in your car. Well, I was driving down the road, got to another red light next to another car, same noise. Now, as you can see, this car only has 138 919. And I'm gonna start it up and I'm gonna let y'all hear. It's unfortunately, this is the one that was making all that noise. You can hear a little bit of the tapping on it. Sounds like it's, you know, this side of the engine here. But I could be wrong. Uh, I'm gonna give it a little rev. You know, let you hear that whole rod down there knocking to come out. And it really disappoints me because I just put a lot of money into this car, putting a hub bearing and a drive axle. So. Listen to it when I rev it up. Yep. Yeah. Pitiful. Pitiful, pitiful. And once I rev it up, you can hear the, the tapping in it a little bit better. So, the next plan for this car is Trying to locate another 3800 motor. You know, take the motor out. And swap it over. As you can tell, this car is not in that bad shape. I did buy this car a few months back. I gave 1200 bucks for it. The guy used it as a construction vehicle and uh, it was completely filthy on the inside. And, uh, but, that's uh, the car's in real good shape. No rust whatsoever, two owner car. It's always lived its life here in Kentucky. So, what? I'm gonna keep y'all updated on this car as I find some parts and the motor for it. I was shoot some videos of me taking that out, replacing it with another one. So I'm in the market right now. I did locate a couple, uh, couple 3800s, uh, waiting to hear back from a couple people and uh, whatnot. So hopefully, I can get another low mileage, uh, low mileage motor for that car. That's a good riding car, you uh, know. We'll see, but stay tuned with that car, and uh, we'll shoot videos and get the motor out of it. And this bad motherfucker here, we're going to F Body Track Day up in Ohio Valley. And uh, I got to get it cleaned up and whatnot. And uh, 
I'm gonna make a video of that tomorrow up at the track. But uh, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't make these videos very good. I'm trying my best, but uh, just keep updated with me. Uh, just hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, comment below on uh, on any of the videos that you see that I post, and uh, we'll catch you on the next video.